We out here at uh, Windermere Prep, about to get a workout in with 2018 point guard Ronaldo Segu, born and raised in Orlando, Florida. We feel like he's the best point guard in the state, so we really, just right now, just a basic workout, getting reps up, ball handling, some shots. Um, he's got summer league going on right now. We're getting ready for a big summer out on the circuit, so just maintaining pretty much every day. My name is Ronaldo, but people call me Rondo. I'm from Orlando. What I really do all day is just wake up, go train, just keep on training and training, try to get better every day, try to be the best PG in the state of Florida. There's a lot of good PGs out here. Just got to compete, be the best, and that's all. Just wake up, eat, grind. That's what my life is. Then I got tournaments, got a UA finals coming up, got to perform, I had no mercy. First realized when I was like eighth grade, people started to notice me more. I wasn't really that known, but I just kept on working. And then when I had got my first write up, my eighth grade year at Panama City, kept it in my head to just never be satisfied, try to get more. The thing I love about basketball is you get better at any time, just like facilitating, some of my teammates get better. Sometimes when my teammates in slumps, just talk to them, make them get better. You can always get better in the sport. You can get better in any sport, but basketball is just fun. Two years ago now, I would be training kids up at Dr. Phillips Y. First met Brad was at local YMCA, Dr. Phillips YMCA. In the morning, I was working out by myself. And I was up there pretty regularly, five days a week, all crazy hours, 5 a.m., 6 a.m., late at night. And every time I was there, I would see this kid would always be on, on the other end, on the other floor, watching what I was doing when I was working kids out and doing the same thing. And so I noticed the kid was pretty good, had some skill, really quick with the ball. So that went on for about two, three months. One day I just asked the kid, I was like, where do you play, who do you play for? And he told me some local team here in Orlando. And I invited him to run one day with us. We had a tournament, I think it was Bob Gibbons in Atlanta. I talked to his parents and they said, okay. He came, I think that weekend just blew up. Everyone wanted to know who the kid was. And from there on out, he's been, he's been a building block for us. From then on out, we just been rocking. You know, we really do think he's the best uh, point guard in 2018. I think nationally, he's going to be one of those guys. I started playing basketball when I was like three. Just kept the ball in my hands all my life. and just kept on with it. I was just in there just wanting to be the best. Got up every day at six, made my parents drop me off. And I will just watch videos on YouTube, and I will just do it at the Y. My goals this year was to get an offer this year. Hopefully I get one. And then another goal I had was to be the number one PG state of Florida. Hopefully get to college division one, get to the NBA, that's my other goal. Hopefully this could be my city. And now it's starting to be a big basketball place. A lot of kids starting to get better out here. A lot of the kids just trying to be great out here working every day. I love playing with uh, Showtime Hoots. They made me better, made me aggressive, stronger, made me the best. And Nazir Little, He's one of the best wing players in Florida or the country. He could be top five. He's just really good. Man, got stupid bounce. So, not really hard to not notice him. So, a really good player, really good person. And I just love playing with him and Showtime. That boy, hey, he's just cold the rock. Like, he can do anything. Like, he can handle it. Great passer. He can shoot. I mean, like, it's, that's like my first time playing with an elite point guard like that. So at first, it was kind of, I had to kind of get used to it because I was used to playing like point guards that were just okay and they didn't really know how to dribble that well and stuff like that. But uh, playing with Rondo, he's really helped me a lot. And the thing I love about him is he makes everybody better on the court. He plays with so much passion on the defensive end that it just helps inspire everybody else to just play harder and stuff like that. Rondo is very slept on. He's probably one of the most slept on players in the whole class because I feel like, in my eyes, he's the number one point guard in the state. Probably top five, top 10 in the nation. He should be getting more recognition and stuff like that, but I feel like his time's gonna come eventually. Good job. So the biggest thing for him is, is just him buying into the process of what it takes to be an elite one today. Um, so pick and roll things, court vision, getting the ball up the floor the right way. And you know, he's really bought in. You know, you deal with kids now and, and they want to be on camera and, and all this stuff. He just wants to get better. He's in the gym every day working on his craft. He's, he's at the Y, 5 a.m. before school every single day putting the work in. So he's really dedicated to the process. So we're, we're really excited about him. It's nice to have a kid who is from Orlando and wants to stay in Orlando. A lot of these kids try and transfer out to prep schools. You know, Rondo wants to stay at Olympia all four years and really put the whole city on his back. One more. Corner.
Kyrie. I just like the way he dribbles, just the moves he do, and just make his teammates better. I'm just trying to be the best, and that's all it is. Got one quote from D'Angelo Russell. Whoever guards me, I would destroy. Just kill everybody who guard me. When I first played against Damian, a lot of people was like hyping him up, saying he was going to kill me and stuff. And I came out, played the best defense. He's a great player. I just had to stop him. I mean, I went at him. I ain't scared of nobody. I got to keep on working. Got to get stronger. Hardest thing for me just to get stronger, get a tone on my body, be consistent, and just grind. If I keep on working hard, anything can happen. Thank <laughs> you.